I got on hope, I started worshiping, and the Lord reminded me what I had studied this morning about the word Hallel. Um, in Jewish terminology, let's, let's say Hebrew, Hallel, um, it's the first part of Hallelujah. It means to praise, to show forth praises, Hallel, the praises. In Psalm chapter 113 through 118 are magnificent praises unto the Lord, Hallel. So when I say hallelujah, I'm thinking praises to Yah. But I'm not going to want to praise him and thank him and worship him if I have no relationship with him. He's not going to respond to my cues because he's not familiar with them. Although he knows everything about me, I have no time in the saddle establishing a relationship with him. So all of these trainers that have had hope and she's learned to respond to them and to their voice. When I brought her home, I had to talk to her, spend time with her, speak to her on a daily basis. I never come out of the house and I never leave the yard or come into the yard without hope speaking to me. Now, not every horse is going to do that. But we have a relationship, and I understand her a little better now after 16 months, and she understands me, and she understands I'm her master. I'm your master, Hope. Yeah, that got her head up. Yeah, she's yawning again. The point is, saints, is that you have a master. His name is Yahushua, the just one. He is the only one, and he is the just one, and he is just one. Put some time in the saddle, saints. You can pray until you're pink or blue or purple or dead in the grave. But if you don't have a relationship with to whom you are praying, you're, you're speaking to the air, and that's probably why your prayers are going unanswered because I'm, I'm not going to get in the Word of God. I'm not going to open it up. I'm not going to pray and then back up with the Word of God what I've prayed or what answer I think I've had. That tells me, saints, whatever comes out of your mouth is going to tell on you. It's either going to condemn you or justify you. So if you're going to sing praises to Yah, hallelujah, remember that Jewish word, hallel, praises, oh, look, look at the hat. Tell you what, that wind gets these things. I just want to encourage you today to sing praises to the Lord, um, spontaneous. He loves spontaneous worship and praise, not will worship, not when... Oh, I got to go to church. I got to get my worship on. I got to get the praise team to, to get me going and pumping me up. There's something wrong, saints. Because if you ain't staying pumped up and in the presence of the Lord, you might want to go back to the Word, open it up, pray, get answers in the Word about what to pray. And when you get a response, line it up with the Word so that you know that it's the Lord speaking to you and not yourself and not an, an evil voice. Because it'll sound just like you and you'll think it's even God. Because it's a little G God. Come on, Hope. She's like, Mom, you already rode me. You've already talked. I want my breakfast. Well, people want to see your pretty face too, Hope. Not just mine. As a matter of fact, Miss Hope, I think your face is so pretty, we could just make them think that you're speaking. No, that wouldn't work. Anyhow, saints, hello to y'all. Ha <laughs> ha! Praises be to the Lord God Almighty. I praise him and thank him for Miss Hope this morning, uh, the Mount of Olives. I praise and thank him just for his majesty and his gloriousness. And saints, I praise him and thank him for you. I love the Lord. I love people. And because I love people, I'm going to keep telling them the truth, even if it hurts their feelings, because, <coughs> excuse me, I would rather hurt someone's feelings and tell them the truth and help them to wake up out of their spirit of slumber, the spirit of stupor, than to have them wake up one day and realize they missed 
eternity with the Lord because nobody loved them enough to tell them the truth. Stop, stop with the fence there, Hope. Hey, Hope, Hope. She's like, what, what? I'm trying to scratch my face. Anyhow, I'm going to get off her and uh, brush her. No, you don't want me to get off? She just shook her head no. Anyhow, I'm going to get off her and brush her face and clean her up and feed her and go pray with my prayer partner. And um, we're going to put some more random acts of kindness together and some care packages. This is the last week of the month and people are really hungry. So I would encourage you saints to go put some care packages together and go feed some hungry people. Um, give yeah some hello first hallelujah god bless you i love you saints yes she's shaking her head yes she loves you too so god bless you i love you saints a sister with a testimony on the mount of olives and um the blood of yahushua covers you hides you protects you and keeps you the blood of yahushua speaks greater things than the blood of Abel and the blood of Yahushua covers you, hides you, protects you, and keeps you in all your ways. The blood has sanctified you, covered you, forgiven you as you reciprocate and respond and receive what Christ did on the cross for you. And Hope is shaking her head yes. So God bless you. I love you. It's uh, Hope and Leslie.